Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you all are doing well. Over the years, I think I have found a good amount of winter items at the thrift store, anything from sweaters to jackets to accessories. And I just wanted to do a video sharing all of those items with you. I thought that would be a really fun idea and hopefully you enjoy this video. If you like thrift hauls or thrift videos, let me know down below. Give this video a thumbs up because I might do this in the summer or spring. I have lots of summer and spring thrifted items, so if you like this video, make sure to let me know and I can definitely do that. But yeah, let's just get on into the video because I have lots of stuff to share. Okay, so I guess we'll start with this sweater because this is probably my favorite sweater of all time. I think I literally wore this sweater in my last video, my sibling Q&A, but I wear this like at least once a week, sometimes more. I just like the length of it because it covers my butt. It's very like oversized so I can wear it with leggings or anything and it kind of just, it just looks really nice. It's like this knit material, I just call it like a knit white sweater and I love it. It goes with everything and I wear it with jeans, I wear it with leggings. I can dress it up, I can dress it down and I think it's just a great basic to have in my collection. That's the thing I look for the most at thrift stores is just those basic pieces. Um, I try to find, you know, everyday sweaters, everyday long sleeve shirts, tank, uh, tank top, short sleeve shirts, things like that, because those are pieces that you will always need. And so getting them at the thrift store, I think is great if you can find them. And then that leads me into the next thing, which, which is this, which is just this basic black sweater. This is originally from Target, I think. It's the brand A New Day. And it's just like the chenille sweater and I wear this all the time. And this is something I have worn over the years and have both dressed up and dressed down. I've definitely just worn this with leggings and I've also worn it to like New Year's parties. I think I wore it like to one New Year party pre COVID and I just put on a nice pair of white pants with it and some heeled boots. And these two sweaters are like my ride or dies. Either I wear this black one or I wear this white one. I wear them all the freaking time. So maybe that's better. Maybe that's worse, I'm not sure. I just tried to make it a little less bright. But this is another sweater that I absolutely love. The only thing is when I wash it, it always gets my hair stuck to it and I don't know how to prevent that. So I have to like lint roll my hair out of this every time I wash it. But this is just a striped sweater that is originally from American Eagle and I love, love, love the colors in it so much. I love this blue. I love this kind of orangey brown color. I just think it's so me and I always gravitate towards striped things and I don't know why, but this was such a good find and I love it. My hair is just everywhere on this sweater. So I have a really hard time finding jeans at the thrift store. I feel like everyone now when they go to the thrift store are looking for mom jeans and that's also probably another reason, especially because the last few years I was doing a majority of my thrifting in my college town and I know every girl who was going to the thrift store was looking for the perfect pair of like Levi's or mom jeans. So that's probably why I couldn't find any is because everyone was all looking for them. But I did find these jeans from American Eagle at a Plato's closet and I really, really like them. I'm wearing them right now, that's why I'm looking down, but You'll see in the b-roll clip, these are just, they go with everything. They're kind of a really blue pair of jeans and I like them because they are tight in the right places and then they're loose in the right places as well. They're like a skinnier mom jean, I'd say. I don't know if I'd call them a mom jean. I did find them on the American Eagle website and they do call them mom jeans, but they're pretty tight for mom jeans, I'd say. I just said mom jeans like 50 billion times, but I just really like them. They've been my go-to pair of jeans over the years and the fact that I found them at a thrift store, I think is pretty great and they were in perfect condition too, so. Okay, so next I have some kind of business wear, I guess you'd call it, like things you'd wear to an interview or to the office, something along those lines. And I am really happy I found all of these because I didn't want to go and buy full price for those things just yet. I think it is good to invest in like a business suit or a nice, you know, work dress, things like that. But for what I was doing, I was doing news anchoring and I kind of didn't want to wear the same dress over and over again because I do have a very nice, I guess it'd be called business appropriate dress, but I didn't want to wear it over and over again because I was doing like multiple news anchoring 
shots and I just wanted to have something different every time so I checked the thrift store almost every single week for those business appropriate dresses and that's a tip that I have for you is if you are maybe starting to do interviews for jobs or if you're a journalism major like me and you're doing some sort of news anchoring or interviewing where you have to wear something a little more professional check the thrift store so first i found this wrap dress i just held that up way too high i found this wrap dress which i wore the very first time i ever news anchored and it was terrifying but i felt super confident in this just wore it with some tights i felt like it was very appropriate and this is originally from forever 21 so yeah that was this was a really good find it was only a few dollars and um, I like it and then this is one that I found at a thrift store. It's kind of just like a basic top I've worn this not in a businessy setting like I think I wore it to like a lunch or a dinner or something But I just threw a cardigan over this and I also wore it in a Like a stand-up. I'll put like a little picture or a clip in here, but I felt like it was it was like business casual, I guess you'd call this top. And then this shirt, I haven't gotten to wear yet, but I thought it was such a good find. It's this really pretty kind of magenta, but like a jewel tone magenta top. And I have no idea where this is originally from, but I just thought it was so beautiful. And one day I'm going to wear this in a business casual setting. I think it would look so cute with jeans and just some boots. And then finally I found this blue dress, which is just a blue polka dot dress. And this is from the brand, a brand called Lush. And I'm not sure where that is originally from or if it's like a little boutique or something, but it's just this blue polka dot dress, very simple. And then I wore a cardigan with it. So I would have definitely gotten more, like every week I would go and check to see if they had something that I could add to my business attire. But I only had to do like two news anchoring things. I don't know what to call them. Before COVID came and I had to go home for the rest of the semester and do everything online so by the way i'm so obsessed with this mug it says rise and shine and it's so cute i got it from target and i will link it down below because i just love it i think it's from the chip and joanna Gaines collection it was over in the stuff that's like i don't know what their brand is called but it was over in the chip and joanna Gaines section so okay so next we have this long sleeve shirt which was a really good find this is originally from we the free and i think that is a free people brand pretty sure it is and it's this striped shirt and i love it so much it has these kind of wider big sleeves and they have these little buttons on them i just think it's such a cute shirt i love it so much and the fact that it's free people is crazy because i know that's a really expensive brand and this is such a good basic just like a denim shirt and this has i've gotten so much use out of this i wore this all through high school all through college i could just throw it on anything and it just looked so cute it's originally from banana republic but i'm pretty sure this is from like the 90s and yeah i just love this so much and i've gotten so so much use out of it and i still wear it to this day it came with some little paint stains on it that won't come off but i, I don't really mind yeah it, i just think it's really cute and such a good basic and i think this is like my favorite thrift store find of all time not even of just winter stuff but like of all time and this is a levi's coat that i actually get questions about all the time and this i found at not really even a thrift store it was like an antique store and it was 20 dollars, which is a little on the pricey side for the thrift store but for a coat and then it's a levi's coat like i thought that was such a good deal and it's just this black corduroy denim look to it got a fuzzy collar and it is a size medium it might be men's i'm not really sure but yeah i thought this was such a good find and i do get questions about this all the time and i found a coat that's like kind of similar that i've been linking when people ask for it but i don't think i, I couldn't find this exact coat but i will link one similar because i do get so many questions about it i thought this was such a good find my sister steals it from me all the time and um i i just love it and then another jacket is this raincoat and i found this uh i think it was this spring or summer and it's just my favorite color pink in a raincoat i really like it and i love wearing just like neutral things with it and then having this be like the pop of pink the pop of color i think it is so 
cute and just so me and also it has these little striped parts it's good it's like a nice light jacket so and it's in my favorite color so i had to get it and now i think we're moving on to accessories already is that everything yeah i guess those are my winter favorites now onto the accessories i'm not sure where this scarf is originally from but i found it in like a goodwill 99 cent bin and i thought it was such a pretty color for fall got my jeans and my white sweater and then this little mustardy brown orange scarf and it's it's an outfit you know i just thought it was such a good piece and it was only 99 cents also this black bag like hello it's <laughs> it's in perfect condition and it has this gold hardware and it's a crossbody bag but also it's a good size so you can hold it like this is kind of a handbag as well but i'm not sure where it's from originally but i thought this was such a good thrift store find just an everyday black bag let me see if i can find where it's originally from so i don't think i yeah, I couldn't find a tag anywhere. Oh, that's where my Ojai lip gloss went. I don't think I've used this bag since last winter, so. And then last but not least, I found these winter boots at the thrift store and I thought they were so cute. They have this little like almost sweater looking material and then they're fuzzy inside and they have a little bit of a heel. I thought they were just good for winter, maybe if there's snow on the ground, but I still wanted to look cute <laughs> going somewhere. And I don't know where these are from originally either. And yeah, I wore them so much last winter. I haven't really been wearing them all that much this winter just because I haven't really been going anywhere, <laughs> but yeah i this was such a good find and yeah guys that was all of my winter thrift find favorites let me think about this those were all of my favorite winter thrift finds but yeah i hope you guys liked this video i love watching thrift hauls so i hope you enjoyed it as much as i enjoyed it enjoy watching them <laughs> i hope you're all having a fantastic new year so far and that everything is going well and you're staying healthy and happy and i will see you guys in the next one Bye guys!